Hi, good morning. It's Monday, it's 10 o'clock. I'm Victoria Derbyshire. Look at this. He's got it! England have won the World Cup by the barest of margins! England's men are celebrating after winning the Cricket World Cup for the first time ever. Owen Morgan's team beat New Zealand at Lords in the most nail-biting and close fourth final in history. Will this achievement spur on the next generation of players? It was like really amazing. It was a miracle and then it was such a wonderful game. I'm not sure that it could happen again in like finals. That was the scene in Trafalgar Square last night as fans celebrated England's historic achievement. We'll have loads of reaction throughout the programme. Let us know where you were watching, how you were watching, how you coped with the nerves and the tension if you are an England supporter. Also today, Labour MPs will push Jeremy Corbyn to make the process for handling anti-Semitism complaints totally independent of the party. We'll talk live to the actress and writer Tracy Ann Oberman, who quit the Labour Party over anti-Semitism. And why have you shot me, Grandad? Were the words of six-year-old Stanley Metcalf after his great-grandfather shot him with an air rifle. Stanley died, and Albert Grannon, who killed him, has been jailed for three years. We'll talk to Stanley's mum, who is fighting now to change the law on control of air rifles. Hello, good morning, welcome to the programme. We're live until 11 this morning. How was that Cricket World Cup final for you? Have you ever seen anything like it? Was it indeed a miracle, as that little girl said in our uh, opening sequence? Tell us how you watched the final super over. What were you thinking? And could you believe it when England won? Use the hashtag VictoriaLive. Send us an email, victoria at bbc.co.uk.